everyone. So today I'm going to show you how to use the Show Your Work feature on both formatives. When you have your problem on both formatives and it's requiring you to show your work, click on the Show Your Work icon. This will take you into the problem. The question appears on the right side of your screen. To remove that out of your way, you can click on the down arrow. To bring it back, you just click on the up arrow. If you are asked to insert an image into your whiteboard, you can click on the image icon, click on my computer, click on your screenshot that you have or image that you are asked to insert and add the image. To move or resize your image, click on the select tool, which is this broken square. Click on the image. You can move it wherever you'd like. If you are asked to insert multiple images, when you insert an image and you do not move it, and you insert another image, your new image will be laid on top of your previous image. This does not mean that your image has disappeared. Click on the select tool, which is the broken square. Click on your image and move your image. You can resize it. You are also able to rotate your image. Make sure the image that you want to rotate is selected. Click on the box that appears above the image. You can rotate it in the direction that you want. In order to insert a text, click on the text tool and type your text. If you need to change the color of your text or the size of your text, you would have to select your color first before you type. It will not allow you to change the color after you have typed. So choose the text color that you like. If you are not happy with the size of your text, click on your select tool, click on the text, and you can resize it and move it to wherever you like. If you need to edit your text, you will need to click on the text tool and then click on where you'd like to edit your text and then you can edit your text however you need it to. There is also a scribble tool. If you prefer to scribble instead of using your text tool, you can also insert shapes that you need. Again, to move your shape, click on the select tool and move it to wherever you need it to go. So if you need more space to work on your whiteboard, you can use the pan tool. This allows you to move your whiteboard so that you can work on another space. You can also use your minimizer and maximizer, which is the mag are the magnifying glasses. Maximize, minimize. Keep in mind that when you minimize and maximize and you go to insert images, your image that you insert might turn out small if you are if you minimize it too much, so be careful with that. To erase, click on the eraser and scroll over whatever you need to erase. If you accidentally erase something, click undo and that will bring your work back. Once you are done with your answer, you can click on the checkbox to mark that it is complete. And that's how you use the Show Your Work feature on both formatives.